How are you? So hi guys, welcome to another class here at Inglés Corporativo. My name is Alejandro Narbona, and I'm going to be helping you with this Principiante 3 class, okay? How are you today, guys? ¿Cómo están? Buenas noches, teacher. Hey, what's up, Américo? How's it going? Good evening, teacher. I am fine. Claudia, thank you very much for being here. Georgie, Jairo, thank you guys for being here today. Gracias por estar aquí. How do you say gracias por estar aquí? Thanks for being here. Repeat it after me. Thanks for being here. Thanks, Thanks for, for being, being here. For being here. For being here. For being here. Correct. Guys, remember, your, your learning comes here. Okay? So, always, <clears throat> siempre tratando de repetir igualito como yo lo digo. Okay? Um, okay. If at some point I pause, it's because I'm drinking a lot of water, I have a sore throat. Ya que estamos hablando de cosas de medicina, sore throat. Sore throat es una garganta irritada. Okay, how do you say garganta irritada? Sore throat. Sore throat, correct. So, sore throat. What can you tell me about yesterday, yesterday's class? What did we cover? ¿Qué cubrimos en la, noche, en la clase de ayer? What did we cover? Um, the parts. Um, body. Body parts, correct. We covered body parts. What else? ¿Qué más? What else? How do you say que más? ¿Cómo se dice que más? What else? Say it with me. What else? What else? What else? What else? ¿Qué más? What Everybody. What else? Else? What, what else? else? What else? Mm -hmm. What else? All right. You know what? What else se escribe, teacher? What else? What? What else? Else. 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 Okay. All right, so, <clears throat> sorry. We covered body parts and we also covered what? I feel, do you remember that? Or I have, how do you say tengo dolor de cabeza? I have a headache. I have a headache. I have a headache. I have a headache. Dolor de estómago? I have, I have a stomach. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Mm -hmm. How do you say, um, tengo gripe? I have the flu. Have flu. The flu, correct. How do you say, tengo diarrhea? Uh, I have. I don't know how to say diarrhea. 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 I'm going to write it down. Diarrhea. What do you say? Diarrhea. Um, tengo alergia. I have allergy. Allergy. Say with me. Allergy. 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 I have allergy. Mm -hmm. Conjuntivitis. Pink eye. Pink, Pink eye. Mm -hmm. eye. Okay. Or you can also say dry eye. But the dry eye. Dry eye. Dry eye. Seco, ojo seco. Pink. Okay. Very good, guys. So today we're going to continue with this topic. But of course, we're going to learn something more. Vamos a continuar con este tema, pero por supuesto. How do you say por supuesto? Of course. Say it with me. Of, of course. course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Por supuesto. Of course. Of course. Pero por supuesto vamos a aprender más cosas. Okay? Are you ready to start? Yes. 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 Let me get it ready here. But first, what is this? Of course. Head. 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 
from head from forehead forehead there you go say with me forehead 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 no nose nose no nose nose chin 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 con n no con n chin chin cheeks cheeks ears ears eyebrows brown eyes eyebrows 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 a los pocos que puedo ver tóquense pero la parte que yo les estoy diciendo ok pongámosle un poquito más de de, de vida okay. a esto, guys. No solo lo que... Come on, hagámoslo un poco más de sentimiento, de saber qué estamos haciendo, right? Again, forehead. 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 Ears. 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 No. Nose. No. Nose. No. 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 Mouth. 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 Si decimos mouse, ratón, okay? So mouth. 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 Teeth. Teeth. Okay, very good. Um, with this one, be careful as well. Si decimos teeth, con la TH acá, miren. Teeth. 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 Chest. 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 Stomach. Chest. Stomach. 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 Very good. Very good. Stomach. Very good. Arm. Stomach. Arm. 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 Fist. 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 Wrist. 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 Right? Wrist. 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 Correct. Wrist. Um, knuckles. Knuckles. Forearm. Forearm. Arm. Arm. Correct. Forearm. Elbow. 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 Now, para decir no seas codo, no seas tacto, no es seas elbow. Okay? It is don't be cheap. It's a different thing. Okay? Don't be cheap. No seas Tacaño. Don't be cheap. Very good. Shoulders. 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 Correct. All right. Shoulders. So the sub with the oh, I forgot. Eyes. 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 Eyelashes. 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 Pestaña. Ahí no se van a apoyar los ojos. Okay. Parto. Eyelids. 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 Very good. Very good. And we have a lot. Tongue. Tongue. Like Shakira Tongue. in the Super Bowl. Right? Tongue. 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 There we go. Tongue. 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 Correct. Tongue. Also, is mm, we gotta say tongue. Okay? Tongue. Tongue. Because if we say tongue, we say tongue. Tongue. Okay? <laughs> So again, pronunciation instead of sacar la lengua, no vamos a decir sacar la tanga. You can get in trouble. All right? So tongue, tongue. tongue. Okay, very good. Fantastic. I'm going to be sharing something with you. Voy a compartir algo con, con ustedes. There we go. Who's going to read with me? By the end of this class, by the end of this, of this class, the end of this class, you will learn the names of common medications 
We learn, we learn the name, the name of, of the medication, medication for health problems. 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 Very good. Me gusta que participen. Muchísimas gracias por eso, guys. No importa que sonemos chuecos, ¿ok? Los bebés empiezan hablando chuecos y después lo perfeccionan. So, ustedes adoptan lo mismo. Say it complete with me. By the end of this class, you will learn the names of common medications for health problems. Go. So, by by the end of this class, you will learn the names of the common medications for health problems. Very good. How do you say problema de salud? Health problems. Health problems. Health problems. Medicinas comunes? Come on. Come on. Medication. Medication. Very good. So guys, al finalizar esta clase, ustedes aprenderán los nombres de medicamentos para problemas de salud. Um, vamos a dejar algo estándar, guys. A veces si yo hablo todo en inglés, hay cosas que no me entienden, ¿verdad? Yeah. Okay. Totalmente normal. That's total normal. So vamos a dejar como estándar, guys. We're going to keep it as estándar. Que voy a decir algo en español. I'm going to say something in Spanish. E inmediatamente, immediately, I'm going to say it in English. Okay? Lo voy a decir en inglés. Okay. ¿Vamos? Okay. All right. So, voy a poner el video. Let me play the video. Share your work in our discussion forums. Silencio en sus micrófonos. Por favor, please mute your microphones. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn the names of common medications for health problems. Let's listen and practice. Common medications. Antacid. Muscle cream. Aspirin. Cough syrup. Cough drops. Cold pills, eye drops. Now, I would like for you to describe. All right, let's go ahead and unmute them, please. Por favor, quitemos el mute, unmute. And uh, let's go ahead and practice the pronunciation. Vamos a practicar la pronunciación. Antiacido. Antacid. 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 Everyone, I need to hear everyone. Antacid. 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 Crema muscular. Muscle cream. Muscle cream. Very good. I love this, guys. Me gusta esto bastante porque aquí podemos ver, here we can see, que el inglés escrito, written English, es súper diferente al inglés hablado. All right, it is very different to spoken English. Aquí no decimos mostly, decimos muscle. 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 Quitamos la C y quitamos la E. No vamos a decir muscle tampoco. So, muscle. Muscle. Muscle cream. Muscle cream. Very good. Aspirin. Aspirin. Vamos a decirlo tres veces. Aspirin, aspirin, aspirin. Aspirin. Aspirin, aspirin, Very good. Si se fijan la I de en medio, no la decimos. If you notice the I in the middle, we don't say it. No vamos a decir aspirin. We don't say aspirin, we say aspirin. 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 Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough drops son como pastillitas, aunque drops significa gota, right? Cough drops. Cough drops. Cough drops. Drop, 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 drop. Drop. Very good. Pastillas para el resfrío. Cold pills. 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 
Very good. All good. If you notice, aquí viene un poquito, guys, también de, de contexto. Porque cold is free. Right? Ustedes pueden ver que dice cold beers, cervezas heladas. Cold beer. Pero acá no es que sean pastillas heladas. Sino que cold significa también tener frío o tener un resfriado. Todo depende del contexto, ¿ok? So, how do you say pastillas resfriado? Cold beers. Cold beers. Very good. How do you say, well, gotas para los ojos, eye drops. Eye drops. Eye drops. Eye drops. Eye drops. So, let's say this faster. Antacid. Antacid. Aspirin. 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 Muscle cream. Muscle cream. Cream. Syrup. Cow syrup. Cow syrup. Cow traps. Good. Cow traps. Cow traps. Oh, nada más como consejo. Let me give you an advice. Este, la U, G, H, es un fonema que, su que suena como la Simplemente como la F. Cup. 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 Cups. Cup. 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 Antiacido. Eh, oh, This one. Es an, antas, antastic. Antacid, very good. Estaba muy cerca, muy bien. Um, yeah. Américo, how do you say crema muscular? Muscle. Muscle cream. There you go. Jennifer, how do you say aspirina? Aspirin. Very good. Oscar, how do you say jarabe para los dos? Cold. Cold syrup. Stay with me. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Good job, sir. Edith, how do you say um, pastillas para la garganta? Para los dos. Cup drop. Cup, cup, cup drop. Correct. Cup. And Virginia, how do you say pastillas para los friados? Cold pills. Excellent. Jairo, how do you say gotas para los ojos? Eye drop. Eye drop. Very good. Antonio, how do you say um, jarabe para los ojos? Cold drop. Cup drops. Correct. Cup. Marta, how do you Cup. say how do you say antiacido, Marta? Antacid. Antacid, fantastic. Let's go ahead and continue with the video. Vamos a continuar con el video. Por favor, muten sus micro micrófonos. Please mute your microphone. What you take whenever you have a headache, for example. Whenever I have a headache, I take aspirin. Whenever I have a cold, I take... Give as many examples as you can. Look at the vocabulary from our previous lesson and describe what you take for each illness. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forum. Alrighty, guys. So, lo que vamos a hacer ahorita, what we're going to do right now, es que vamos a abrir los break rooms. Okay? We're going to go to the break rooms. Una vez estemos ahí, vamos a decir esto. Whenever I have a headache, I take aspirin. Cuando yo tengo dolor de cabeza, I take aspirin. Whenever I have diarrhea, I take antacid. 
or if you want to say the brand that you use, if you quiero decir la marca que ustedes ocupan, pues digámoslo. Okay? Uh, whenever I have a cold, siempre que tengo un resfriado, yo tomo. ¿Qué tomamos cuando tenemos resfriados? Cold pills. Cold pills. Cold. Good. Um, ¿Qué pasa cold. cuando tenemos un músculo adolorido? I take, I don't know. I take mm -hmm. muscle cream. Okay. Yes and no. Good job, good job. Yeah. Me gustó que lo dijera, pero acá, el muscle cream, vamos a ocupar... Hot. I, I apply, me aplico muscle cream, porque si nosotros oh, decimos no. I take muscle cream, es como que nos le estamos comiendo y no funciona así, ¿verdad? Así que vamos a decir I apply muscle cream. Me pongo. Ok. Ok. So, si nos vamos a tomar algo, ya sea pastillas, ya sea. ¿Ahora hay pastillas? Pills. Pills, correct. Um, how do you say. Um, jarabe? Syrup. 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 Ahí vamos a ocupar take, pero si es algo que nos vamos a aplicar, ocupamos apply. ¿Qué pasa con right. los eye drops? Do we take them or do we apply them? Apply. Exactly. What happens with the muscle cream? Apply. Apply. To apply. apply. And pass it? Yeah. Take. 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 Cough syrup? A take. 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 Cold pills? Uh, take. take. Aspirin? Take. 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 So guys, do me a favor. Um, take a picture of this. Tomen un screenshot, perdón. Take a screenshot. Share it to the group. Compártalo al grupo. Y nos vamos a los break rooms por cinco minutos. Okay? Vamos a ocupar lo mismo. Repeat after me. When I have a headache. Uh -huh. When I have a headache. When I have a headache. I take aspirin. I take, I take aspirin. When I have a cold. When I have, when a, I have a cold. I take. I take. I take. Cold pills. Cold, cold pills. pills. Cold pills. When I have, whenever, perdón, whenever I have pink eyes. ¿Qué son los pink eyes, guys? Conjuntivitis. There you go. Excellent. Whenever I have pink eyes, I apply eye drops. Repeat, please. Whenever I have pink eyes, whenever, whenever I, I have pink, 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 pink eyes, eyes, I apply eye drops. I apply. I apply eye drops. All right. Very good, guys. So, vamos a ocupar las enfermedades que vimos ayer y ahora vamos a poner el medicamento. Okay. So we're going to use yesterday's illnesses, and today we're going to use, uh, we're going to work on the medication. So guys, voy a abrir los grupos ahorita, accept the invite, and let's get to work. Okay. Please accept the invite. Por favor, accept, accept la invitación. Five minutes, and then we'll go back. Cinco minutos y regresamos. Check the chat. You have some illnesses there. There we go. Idol, Edith, medical. Good job. Let's go ahead and check the work. But first, let me set the timer. Five minutes. All right, timer set. Now let's check the progress. Uh -huh, guys. I want to hear you talking, guys. Quiero escucharles hablar. Es que nos recordamos las enfermedades de ayer. Lo único que les puedo decir es a eso. Que va, 
बार बार है कम ऑन यूज योर रिसोर्सेज ऑक्यूपे सो रिसोर्सेज पोंगा आई एन इंग्लिश इसके एनफर्मिडेडेस कॉमन कॉमन इलनेस है हाउ डू यू से बुलर द कैबेसा हेड एक हेड एक स्टमक एक um i take um coke syrup there you go coke syrup exactly next one america uh eh dolor de cuerpo se dice body ache yeah you can say body ache body ache body ache mm -hmm. i have body ache mm -hmm. uh I apply muscle cream. There you go. There you go. También puedo oh. decir sore muscle. Sore muscle. Mm -hmm. uh, I I take a, a pills. I take a pill. Okay. I take a pill from from. I take an aspirin, right? Yes. All right. From, Fantastic. From the from the body ache ache. For for the body ache. For the body ache. Correct. Yes. Idle. Your turn. You're doing good. Whenever uh, I have a head, ¿cómo se dice dolor de cabeza? Me olvidó. Headache. Headache. Mm -hmm. um, I take aspirin. Okay. Very good. You're doing good. Let's go ahead and continue. I wrote more illnesses on the chat. So you have more ideas, all right? Continue. Una y una, una y una. I'm going to check another okay. group. Okay. Okay. Oh. Eh, era dolor de cabeza. Uh -huh. I have a... I have the flu. Whenever I have the flu. Whenever I have the flu, it's a gripe, right, teacher? Yes. Yes. Um, yeah, se me olvidaron los medicamentos. <laughs> Go ahead and check the screenshot. Uh, here we are. Uh, for the flu, take... Um, <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, okay. <laughs> Cirrus... Cold syrups. No, no es para la toma. Cold syrups. Cold syrups. Cold syrups. Ah, el jarabe, la verdad. Yes. All right, continue. Now, Antonio. Okay, whenever I have a cold. I take uh -huh. okay. when I have the flu mm -hmm. okay whenever I have the flu I gripe uh -huh. Um, in this class, you'll learn the names. Come on, Antonio, you can do it. Whenever you have the flu, Muscle I take aspirin. I take cough syrup. Okay. La gripe es muy común, muy común a los resfriados. So, tú puedes tomar los medicamentos similares. I take a. Uh, Uh, Viro grip. <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> muy bien, muy bien. No tiene que ser solo el vocabulario. Apply nasal spray. <laughs> I apply nasal spray. Good job. It is. Cough 
Our vocabulary. Excellent. No era receta, Tich. No. <laughs> okay, pensamos que era receta. All right, very good. Nice to play. All right, let's go back to the main group, guys. Okay. Okay. Tich. Alrighty, guys. So, Claudia, Antonio, and Edith, thank you very much for being here. Let's go ahead and share. Vamos a, voy a compartirles algo más. I'm going to share something else with you. Voy a compartir el otro topic. The next topic we are going to, to cover. All right, very good. So this one is similar. Read it with me, please. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. Come on, guys. Lesson objective. Como que si no fuera jueves y que ya mañana no se conectan. Con ganas. <laughs> Lesson. <laughs> Lesson objective. Muchas gracias a la única persona que lo dice. Again, everybody. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. Lesson, lesson objective. By the end of this class, by the end of the class, you will learn how to use positive and negative imperatives. You will learn how to use positive and negative imperatives. Additionally, additionally, you will also practice a conversation. You will also practice a conversation. Which illustrates how this topic. Which illustrates how this topic is used in real life setting. Is used in real life setting. Internet is bad. Okay, don't worry, we understand. So, guys, um, al final de esta clase, <clears throat> o al final de esta clase, ustedes aprenderán cómo usar los imperativos positivos o negativos. ¿Qué es un imperativo? ¿Alguien sabe? ¿No? Pues les comento. Un imperativo es una orden, un comando, así de simple. Adicionalmente, ustedes practicarán una conversación, la cual ilustra cómo este tema es usado en un escenario de la vida real. ¿Ok? Now, consejito, porque escuché que a algunos les, creo que a varios les cuesta estar leyendo y tratar de repetir. Si ustedes se fijan, hoy les dije cosas más largas. ¿Ok? Ustedes no saben que en verdad saben. ¿Ok? Así que, por favor, quiero que se metan eso muy, muy dentro en la cabeza. Nosotros mismos somos la primera limitante para el aprendizaje. Porque decimos, no puedo. Entonces, simplemente expongas. Y se van a dar cuenta que quizás han escuchado cosas que tienen grabadas en la mente pero como no las prácticas no han salido. Pero sí saben, lo que pasa es que no saben que saben. All right? Así que den lo mejor. Poco a poco les voy a ir dando más cuerda y a la vez les voy a ir socando la pita. Quiero, voy a querer que repitan más, que repitan con mejor actitud, que repitan más rápido, que repitan igual que yo y que no se traben tanto. Pero si se creen que lo van a lograr, lo van a lograr. Si dicen no puedo, mejor desconecten. Pongan a ver YouTube en español. Que es lo mismo, no van a aprender. All right? So, guys. Okay. Um, go ahead and read it with me, please. Léanlo conmigo. Imperatives and conversation. Imperatives and conversation. Don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. How do you say no trabajes demasiado, demasiado duro? Don't, don't work too hard. Work too hard. Too hard. Too hard. Very good, guys. Uh -huh. Again. Ya sabemos, silenciamos los micrófonos, mute your microphones, because we're going to play the video. Vamos a poner el video. Title, Don't work too hard. Let's listen and practice. 
Don't work too hard. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. The All right. Before we go with this, guys, unmute your microphones, please. Unmute. Unmute your microphones. Okay. And let's go ahead and read with me. Hello, Miss West. Hello, Miss West. Hello, Miss West. Hello, Miss West. How are you? How are you? How are you today? How are you today? Not so good. Not, Not so, so good. good. Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? So what's wrong? What's wrong exactly? Exactly. I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. 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 Hmm. Why are you so tired? Why, Why are, are you, you so, tired? so tired? Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Please, espera un momento. No escuché que todos dijeran el hmm. 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 Ah, uh -huh. okay. Mm. Very good. So, <laughs> hmm. like we are thinking, mm. right? Como que estamos mm. pensando. Acuérdense, esto que estamos haciendo tratan de hacerlo igual que yo. Ustedes tienen que poder lograr hablar que yo, igual que yo en un futuro cercano. Right? So, hmm. why are you so tired? Hmm. Why are, are you, so tired? you so tired? Hmm. Unos me hicieron trampa, pero bueno. Um, I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. I don't, I don't know. I just no, can't, I can't sleep, sleep at, night. Night. At, night. At, night. at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. Okay. A few minutes later. A few okay. minutes later. A few later. minutes later. I'm going to give you some pills. I'm, I'm going to give, give, give you, you some, some, pills. some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. All right. Fantastic. Very good. Now, a couple of exercises, un par de ejercicios que les recomiendo cuando vean conversaciones como esta. When you see conversations like this, um, pásenlas en español. Ok. Translate them to Spanish. Así ustedes van agarrando vocabulario. Ok. Very good. Let's continue with the, with the video. Microphones on mute, please. Dr. Young. The conversation that we just heard illustrates the conversation between a doctor and a patient. Typically, whenever we are sick and we go to the doctor, we're going to receive instructions from the doctor so that we can get better. We use imperatives to give instructions. Imperatives. Take a pill every four hours. Rest in bed. Drink lots of juice. Don't work too hard. Don't stay up late. Don't drink soda. To form imperatives is very simple. Just add the verb. No subject is necessary. Then a complement. On the left hand side of the chart, we can see positive imperatives. Let's analyze them. Take a pill every four hours. The verb is take. The complement is a pill every four hours. On the right hand side of the chart, you can see negative imperatives. Don't work too hard. In this case, we're going to follow this next formula. Don't 
plus verb plus complement. Don't. Don't. Work is the verb and the complement to har. Now, I would like for you to give some examples of your own. Think of the advice or instructions that you or your doctor gives whenever you have some kind of illness. For example, if you have a cold, take cough syrup, don't drink cold drinks. After you finish this task, all right, very good. So guys, ¿cuántos de ustedes han ido al seguro? How many of you have gone to the East? I am. No. Yeah. I am. Um, um, yes. ¿Han ido a doctores particulares? Have you gone to private doctors? Yes. Yes? Yes. yes. So, siempre nos dan recomendaciones que no nos gustan. Right? Yes. Yes. Right. They always give you recommendations we don't like. For example, no coma dulces. How do you say no coma dulces? Don't, Don't eat candies. candies. No tome soda. Don't, Don't drink soda. soda. Don't drink soda. No tome café. Don't, Don't drink coffee. Don't drink coffee. No tome té. Don't drink tea. Don't drink tea. No ande de cochino. <laughs> Don't eat pork. All right, very good. So uh, take a shower. Take a shower. There you go. So we all know the recommendations. Todos sabemos las recomendaciones. Por ejemplo, guys. Uh, obviously, this is in Spanish. I don't know if you can. No, you can see, right? ¿Qué dice ahí? What does it say? One tub. One tub. One tub. One pill. Every, one pill. Every for eight or Every hours. Eight hours. Very good. So, who's going to be my doctor right now? I need a volunteer. Necesito un voluntario que sea mi doctor. No importa que no sepan, igual que en el seguro. Okay. Claudia, thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> Doctor, I have, I feel sick. Look, I feel sick. Um, I think I have the flu. What should I do? Um, not, uh, don't, don't work too hard. Thank you. Bye bye. Ahorita me desconecto. Okay. Um, what else? ¿Qué más? Don't um, drink soda. Okay, fantastic. Y ocupando los imperativos positivos. Ya me dijo. Take a. Take a. Um, Mm. Take a. Take um. Sleep. Yeah. Descansa. Yeah. Ah, that would be get some rest. Some rest. Uh -huh, okay. Take, do a, take a. Take some rest. Uh huh. Get some rest. Uh, get take some rest. um. One more. One more. How do you say? Call. Call. Feel. Feel. Feels. What? Say it again. Take a cold pills. Take. No, ese era para qué? No recuerdo. Cough syrup. Eso es para todos. But don't uh, worry. Después si le da después, pues sí. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Better be. Estoy del seguro, acuérdese. Exactly. Better be safe than sorry. <laughs> okay. So, how do you say mejor prevenir que lamentar? Yeah. Better be safe than sorry. 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 All right, guys. So quickly, como ustedes pueden ver, 
los imperativos son órdenes, comandos, como les estaba mencionando anteriormente. ¿Ok? So, el doctor no nos pregunte, mire, ¿se quiere tomar las pastillas? No. ¿Quiere descansar? ¿Quiere que le den capacidad? ¿Cuántos días? ¿Ok? So, those are commands. That's what they are called. Commands, imperatives, orders. Things you have to do. So, the only difference, la única diferencia que tiene, guys, con las oraciones es que no llevan sujeto como pueden ver en el video. All right? All right. Take a pill every four hours. Take a pill every eight hours. Um, rest in bed. Drink lots of juice. Beba mucho jugo. Y luego nos vamos a los negativos. Don't talk too much. No hable mucho. Don't work too hard. No haga ejercicio. Don't do exercise. Okay. Don't drink soda. Don't stay up late. No se queden hasta tarde. Etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. All right. All right. Are we clear on this? Estamos claros en esto, guys. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Porque en el knowledge check van a comprobar si estamos claros o no. All right. Now, right. We'll go ahead and do something, something real quick before we go to the, to the um, to the groups. All right. So, dentist. ¿Qué creen que va? Don't, don't go. Don't drink. No. No se tome un dentista. Don't go. No, no, no. No, no, se, no se coma a un dentista. Don't go. No vaya al dentista. Sí. Sí. Ajá. Vamos a ver. Sí, a dentist. Very good. Too much. Don't, don't, don't eat. Don't eat too much. Puede ser. No coma mucho. Don't, don't worry. Oh, that can be another one. Ajá. Uh -huh. Don't worry. Para two aspirants? No, don't take. It's take. 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 Okay, let's see. Take, take two aspirants. Two aspirin. Esa es uh, plural y regular. School. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go to school. Todos felices. In bed. Which one do you think? Stay. 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 No Stay. 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 Stay in bed. Vamos a ver. A doctor. Sí. Call. Sí. Call. Sí. Sí. Ya ocupamos sí. Veamos call. Teacher, the first one is call. We'll, we'll check. We'll check it right now. Don't worry. Vamos, ya la vamos a ver. Okay. Coffee. Don't, don't drink. Don't drink. Don't drink. Don't drink. Any candy. Don't eat. Don't eat. Very good. So, don't eat any candy. Don't drink coffee. Call a doctor. Stay in bed. Stay in bed. Don't, don't go to school. school. Take, Take two aspirin. Here. Eat. Don't, Don't worry. Aha, uh -huh, because we already have that one. Let's see the results. Oh, who said that? Who said that? Ah, Jennifer. Good job. <laughs> that was going to be call a dentist and see a doctor. See. All right, there we go. Fantastic. So, guys, remember to do this yourself. Acuérdense hacer esto ustedes. Es que lo hice con la clase en el teacher. No vale. Okay. Esa es tu plataforma, tu 80%. So, yo me estoy ganando mi 80% en cada clase. Okay. Tal vez me dan diploma también a mí. All right. So, guys, right now, what we're going to do is that I'm going to open the break rooms. And you're going to pretend you have fever, diarrhea, um, the flu, whatever you want. 
but give yourself recommendations. The coronavirus. Coronavirus, chingungunya, whatever you can imagine, <laughs> and you can use the names of the um, of the medication. Pueden ocupar el nombre de las medicinas. Okay. Estamos claros con lo que vamos a hacer. Yes. ¿Qué vamos a ocupar? Water, acid, what? Clear as water. water. Vamos a ocupar imperativos. Démosle, guys. Accept the invite, please. There you go. Very good. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got seven minutes, guys. Well, five minutes, five minutes. Five minutes. There we go. <clears throat> Everybody participating. Setting the timer. And let's see what they're doing. But the circle receta. Okay. Um for example, I have a, I have a flu. I have the flu. I have, I have the flu. Don't drink uh, cold, cold drinks. Good. Good recommendation. Um, uh, Don't drink soda. Don't drink soda. Try to use affirmative too. Thank you. Affirmative too. Oh. Um, you take a rest. Good. Um. Uh. You take a, a soap. Eat. Coma sopa? Eat. Yes. Mm -hmm. Eat chicken soup, Eat. like the super magic. Eat medication. chicken soup. Yes. All right, guys. You're doing good. Traten de meter más enfermedades y el otro da, pero no se preocupen negativos. Están haciendo lo excelente. Voy a ver otro grupo. Okay. okay. Thank okay. you. You're welcome. Um, take one pill of oh, oh. hi everyone in this class you learn how okay and don't take don't work too hard take don't stay up late is don't drink so to stay thin in your bed for for three Just days <laughs> Stay in bed for three days. Lovely. That's fantastic. Super good recommendation. Okay. <laughs> okay, take a feel every um three hours. Good. Um Kumara, rest in watch television. <laughs> uh, drink a uh, ginger ginger tea. <laughs> All right, very good. Remember, change the illness, guys. Cambien la, la enfermedad para que puedan ocupar su, su imaginación. Let me check the other group. You're doing la gripe for okay. the flu. What? The flu, perdón. I have coronavirus. I have no, coronavirus, no, teacher. No lo invoque. Okay, okay. In China. Let's... I don't have... <laughs> All right, all right. Okay. Stay quiet. Um, okay. I have a headache. Headache. See headache. And what else? 
A ver qué me recomienda para el dolor. Only, you have only headache. Sí. Yes. Okay. If you have a headache, take a pill every five hours and don't work too hard. Good job. Uh -huh. Hey, you're, you're if, doing good, but don't stop. You, <laughs> Oscar, if you have a, um, a headache, uh, dream a lot of juice and a lot of water. There you go. Good job, guys. I like what I'm hearing. Let's go back to the main, to the main room, okay? Okay. All right. All right, fantastic. So, guys, uh, do you find this topic easy? ¿Se encuentran fácil? So, so. So, so. All right. Remember that it's a matter of practice. You gotta practice, 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 and practice. Guys, con el inglés, no hay, it's not rocket science. Cuando se dice rocket science, significa que no es complicado. All right, tienen la suerte de de tener a alguien que los está ayudando, o sea yo o sea o algún otro maestro, pero lo único que ustedes necesitan es practicar. Right? Se los digo siempre, finalizar prácticamente de cada clase. No necesitan sentarse a estudiar. No traten de acordarse o medio lleven su cuaderno, llévenlo en su teléfono, lo que sea. En la hora de lunch, masticando y hablando, se oye feo. Pero siempre si ustedes tienen un, un objetivo, tienen que dar lo mejor de ustedes. Okay? No es imposible. Okay. Solo es cuestión de hacer un esfuerzo. So, guys, uh, thank you very much for being here. Muchas gracias por estar aquí. Um, remember, no classes tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday. So you can study tomorrow. You can practice tomorrow. Okay? Hoy entró a una clases una muchacha y le dijo, no se le olvidó algo. No. Dos días después, yo le andaba a su cuaderno su libro en el botón. Qué bonito estudio esos dos días, la niña. All right? So... Do your best, guys. Do your best, guys. I wish you the best. Hope you have a good weekend. Thank you very much for being here. Part of a class at Inglés Corporativo. My name is Alejandro Narbona. It was my pleasure. See you Monday, my friends. Rest good tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Take care. Good night. Bye-bye.